Welcome aboard our enchanting summer canal trip along the picturesque Clangochlan Canal. Our captivating journey along the Clangochlan Canal begins right here at this charming hire boat base in Trevor. As we embark on this delightful journey, let's uncover the beauty, history and fascinating facts that made this 63 foot narrowboat adventure truly special. From this picturesque starting point, we'll embark on an unforgettable adventure as we head towards the enchanting town of Clangollan. The Clangollan Canal, located in Wales, is often regarded as one of the most scenic canals in the United Kingdom. Stretching for 46 miles, this waterway traverses through some of the most stunning countryside landscapes you'll ever encounter. These narrow sections are distinctive features of the Clangollan Canal and they harken back to the canal's historic origins. The canal was originally constructed in the early 19th century and its dimensions reflect the technology and engineering of that era. As we meander along this tranquil canal, you'll be captivated by the ever-changing scenery that ranges from lush green meadows to quaint waterside villages. Our vessel Henley, a 63 foot narrowboat, is an ideal vessel for this journey. Our journey also takes us to the charming town of Clangollan, where you can explore its quaint streets, visit the Clangollan Railway, and perhaps even attend the world renowned international Eidsteadford. One of the most charming and historic significant aspects of the Clangollan Canal is the traditional horse-drawn boats, which have been ferrying tourists to the breathtaking Horseshoe Falls for many generations. Cascading waters of Horseshoe Fall are more than just a scenic attraction. They serve as a primary water source for the Clangollan Canal, providing a vital flow necessary to keep the historic waterway navigable. You see, the Clangollan Canal relies on a constant and steady supply of water to maintain its water levels and allow boats to traverse its various locks and narrow sections. We are leaving now to return back to Trevor as this is as far as you can go this way. is only wide enough for one at a time and a runner is sent ahead to stop the oncoming traffic.
The Ponticelli Aqueduct was designed by the famous Scottish civil engineer Thomas Telford. It was completed in 1805 and stands as a testament to Telford's engineering ingenuity. Speaking of the Ponticelli Aqueduct, did you know that it stands a height of 126 feet and spans over a thousand feet across the Dee Valley? It's an engineering masterpiece that provides breathtaking views of the surrounding landscape. It's such a relaxing pace of life. We enter our first lock, the New Martin. Luckily, this is manned by volunteers today raising funds for the Montgomery Canal so we get help going through. We buy homemade cakes as a thank you. at Frankton Junction. The Montgomery Canal features a series of locks and lift bridges, including the historic Frankton Lock Flight, which has five locks in close concession. These engineering features are part of its unique charm. You need lots of energy to operate the lift bridges, We arrive at Whitchurch and moor up for the evening. It's a delightful town to visit. Having reached our halfway point, we turn around and head back to base. This will take three days at a steady speed of three miles an hour. The Clangollan Canal was originally constructed during the late 18th century to transport goods such as coal and limestone to fuel the Industrial Revolution. Ellesmere is very busy and turning takes some concentration. This is Ellesmere Marina, very smart hire boats here.
signalling at what's ahead is crucial. Not quite sure what these signs mean though. The Chirk Aqueduct, a masterpiece of Victorian engineering, gracefully carries our narrow boat high above the enchanting Dee Valley. Standing an impressive 70 feet, this aqueduct offers unparalleled views of the valley below as you cruise across its slender arches. But the adventure does not stop there. Shortly after the aqueduct we enter the Chirk Tunnel, a 421 yard long passageway that takes us through the heart of a hill. As we journey through this dark and mysterious tunnel, it's hard not to be awestruck by the engineering skills that carved this route through solid rock. We pass by Chirk Marina, it's larger than you think. The aqueduct comes into view from a distance, our journey is nearly over. We return our boat to base, having had a fun, relaxing holiday. It's one definitely to be recommended. Thank you for watching.